Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Don. Today I'll have another episode of DaVinci Resolve Tips and Tricks video and I'll show you how to select everything or all to the left or right in DaVinci Resolve. So what happens, uh, let's say if you're editing a video and you have lots of clips and if you'd like to move some clips all together then the usual way would be you just like you know select them manually so for example I'm selecting them this manually and then you can just you know move it to the uh, left or right uh, just holding these uh, this is not uh, an efficient way and today I'll show you how you can do that using simple uh, keyboard command and that's uh, you know much easier and more efficient way to do that watch until the end of the video uh, because I'll give you a tip so you don't forget this ever so put your cursor where you'd like to start the selection process so for example if you'd like to select everything after or forward then just put your cursor here and we are selecting all these parts right here so the command we are going to be using is the first one is y so if you just press y on your keyboard and let's see what happens see what's happening here that it is selecting all clips in the timeline what I mean by that if you take a look here you can see that you know video one and audio one timeline these two are selected so if you just hit Y this is going to select all clips in that timeline after the playhead which is right here so I'll just you know get rid of that now if you'd like to select everything not just the timeline but the whole like you know uh, whatever is there for example effects pictures audio everything then the command you can use is alt and y so let's do that so now you can see that everything is selected so this is going to select everything after the playhead or forward way uh, after the playhead now let's just get rid of that now if you'd like to select everything before the playhead uh, then the command you're going to be using is uh, control y so let's hit control y so now you can see that it's only selecting everything in the timeline which is right here and this is because these two timelines are selected and let's just get rid of that the reason this part is selecting because kind of this is in the middle uh, if you don't want that to select so what you can do you can just like you know, move it a little bit here and let's just hit Control y again and you can see that it's just selecting this portion okay so just get rid of that and if you'd like to select everything uh, the whole thing not just the timeline then the command you're going to be using is Control alt and y and now you can see that everything is selected before the playhead so now the special tip so let's say if you don't want to forget uh, these commands the easy way or the simpler you can find them just by by going to the timeline so if you take a, a look on the upper left corner here is the timeline click on it and then here scroll down a little bit then here you can see that select clips backward uh, basically this is what I just showed you and then select clips forward after and this is also I just showed you so if you you know ever forget these commands you can just come go to the timeline and take a look here select clips backward and select uh, select clips forward for the next DaVinci tips and tricks video I'm going to put a link on the screen and I'll see you in the next video thank you for watching